quick press conference. There we go. Nick Ames for the first question, Nick. Hi, Jürgen. Um, is that the sort of win that wins you titles? Um, if you do it 38 times, yes, absolutely. Um, if you do it once, no. But anyway, it's really important and feels really big today for us, to be honest. Because it was a very difficult game. The wind made football makes football really difficult, and today, especially for the dominant side, it makes it really difficult. Um, we missed a lot of chances, um, and we had to defend the counter attacks of, of Wolves with an incredibly <laughs> um, uh, quick Traoré. And um, so that was was the challenge today. But um, in this difficult circumstance, I like the, the, the game we played because we played between the lines in the first half really well. The, the start was maybe not really not, not outstanding because we had to learn a little bit how we can how we can play them. But uh, when the boys found it out, then it looked really, really good apart from the finishing, obviously, or the last pass, these kind of things. Um, so it was clear, when you don't score, you just have to keep going, and that's what we did. And, yeah, and then Divogorigi, the legend, came and finished it off for us. I love it. Thank you, Nick. We'll go to Paul Joyce and then David Lynch. They're the next two hands have got up, and that's it at the moment. Paul. Yeah, and that, that ability to keep going to the end is something that has been a trademark of your side in, in the past. Um, you know, keep pushing for the for the for the win. And 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 that was shown again really. We said it. We said it after the game. It was like in the good old times, our good old times, like two years ago or so, uh, when we really needed it badly. And um, like Aston Villa or wherever it was, I, I don't remember all of them, but um, it's it's important skill. It's important skill to stay positive. Um, we, we didn't have that. It was not needed too often this season, but it's still uh, an incredibly important um, skill. And um, thank God we could show it today. And, um, but look, it's it's not a lucky win, even though, of course, it's lucky when you're going to score that late, but it's not a lucky win in, in, in the sense of that, that they had no chance after chance. No, we had chance after chance and just didn't score. So I think the point would have been lucky for Wolves. And so it's the right result. Okay, we've got David Lynch and then James Pearce, and that's it for the hands of David. Uh, Jürgen, obviously another big moment for Divock Origi. He constantly comes up with these. Can you explain why he has that knack for scoring big goals? Because he's it's it's, 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 it's an incredible finisher. If we don't know it at Liverpool, who should know it then? So we saw that so often. And um, now I said, it's, it's difficult to, to get 500 minutes a week in this team because of the, the, the players we have. But Debo Gorigi is an incredible football player and he's great in these moments. He doesn't need a lot of run-up or whatever or time to, to, to find into a game, and especially not in this game today. It was his game. He could be Debo Gorigi 100% in and around the box, use your body, use your technique, finish the situations just off. He was unlucky with the all before, I think, was involved in a lot of good moments. It was a threat before he scored. But um, these kind of goals we see plenty of times in training and everywhere. So, and um, yeah. <laughs> so winning in a 95th minute is great. But when Dip scores a goal, it makes it even better. To be honest. Thank you. And at the moment, it's the last question. It's James Pierce, which is the last hand up we have. James. Jürgen, yeah, you mentioned a couple of months ago that, that, that you were expecting an office to come in for Divock last summer. Was did, did you did you actually expect him to move on? Did you think that that might have been the end of his Liverpool career at the end of last season? If, if I would be in another club, I would I would go for him. So and I thought um, that would happen. That's true, because of he didn't have the the the, 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 the massive game time. But again, I cannot believe that people think if you don't play for Liverpool, you have to be you cannot be good. Uh, this team is outstanding, and if you are here, number 12, 13, 14, and you are outstanding uh, for the best. Um, but um, I, I, I'm very happy <laughs> that he's still here, actually, and um, didn't expect it to happen. But I wouldn't, I wouldn't have been surprised. But that's it. Yeah, and he doesn't, he doesn't seem to have a soul or feel sorry for himself when he, when he, when he hasn't been picked this season. He seems to have positively affected games almost every time he's come on, which obviously says a lot about him as a personality. Yeah. Top striker and top boy. That's how it is. He's, uh, he's already for a long time here at Liverpool. Came here very young uh, and scored some of the most important goals in the history of this club. So, yeah, um, he's, he's he's a positive boy. That's true, and I'm really happy. Okay, this is the very last question, John Isaacwood, and then we'll uh, finish for today. John. Oh, 
Paul John, we can't hear you, I'm afraid of the, 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 the headset. If you want to pull the headset out and give it a go. How's that? Perfect, we can hear you now. Can you hear that? Yeah, we um, can. Could you expand, Jürgen, on how important this, this victory was in the context of your season? Because it's not a glamorous victory, it's not a flash victory, but it's a really hard-earned victory that you e eked out. Okay, what do we have today? Match day number? Was it 14? 14, 15, what was match day today? <laughs> Nobody knows which match day? Yes, 15. 15, okay, means we have not even half the season. So that you have glamorous wins like 20, 25 times a year is, is really unlikely. So who cares? Um, we have to win football games in different ways. And today it was that way. The, the game was really difficult. I think you all, you all saw Wolves playing this year very often. It means Wolves usually um, plays completely different football than they, than they were allowed to play against us today so we really pushed them back we really played uh, we, were, we were at them our pressing was outstanding uh, counter press a lot of moments uh, recovery runs great um and then we create chances but it was wind and in and, and the deep defending side and all these kind of things that makes it not easier so and that we are not surprised that the boys stay on track but it's I don't take it for granted as well. So it means I'm really happy that we could show that skill set again today because it um, was for a while not, not needed now, but today it was needed and it's still there and I'm really happy about that. Fantastic. Thank you, everybody. All Thanks. Right. Bye -bye.